What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay, so here we are guys in the Civi Islands. After defeating Blaine, the Fire-type Gym Leader, you know, solving all his puzzles, bottling that one person, getting that Gym Badge, and being surprised by Bill because uh, apparently we have to help him out right here somehow. Now, this portion of the uh, of the whole adventure right here, guys, is optional. You can do this after you defeat the Elite Four, all that stuff, but I chose to do it... Uh, I chose to do it right now because, you know what, let's explore. Let's do a little side quest before we get into the 8th Badge, plus let's level up our Pokémon. So. We're in the Sevi Islands. We only have Zach, we only have access to three islands right now, and that is because, eh, well, we haven't captured 60 Pokemon, haven't defeated the game or anything like that. Plus, Celio and Bill need a little bit of help uh, trying to fix this doodad up because they want us to trade Pokemon from Leaf Green to Fire Red or Leaf Green Fire Red and to Sapphire and Ruby and Emerald. So. That is what we're going to do right here, guys. We're just going to take a small tour of the Sevi Islands, the three islands that we are unable to go to, capture maybe another legendary bird Pokemon, and, I don't know, hopefully get all buffed up before we play, uh, or go up against Giovanni right here. So the first thing is first. Let's go ahead and take a look at a little island right here that many of you guys would probably be surprised at. You can get surprised, or you can get, um... You can get, uh, what was it, rewards, or not rewards, but hidden items every single day. Plus, you'll be battling some strong trainers like this lady right here. Line back, rock by the waves, it's exquisite. Alrighty. So, one of the one of the things that was pretty awesome about this whole uh, new Sevi Island things when it was actually incorporated right here, guys, it was I was actually surprised. Very, very surprised at the fact that they added this to the game because I actually thought that I was going to go to, you know, I actually thought that I had to go to Giovanni, and then that's pretty much it. I was kind of worried, how am I going to level up my Pokemon, or I was actually more worried of the fact, how much time I was going to actually use to level up my Pokemon, and, uh, well, it turns out that they actually, uh, Nintendo actually added a little extra right here, and, uh, well, we're going to be having a little fun right now. As you can see, kicking Seal's ass, that's right, taking a recoil, oh yes. And uh, look at that, Poliwag grows to level 41 and everybody else is just gaining experience points. So, well, let's go right ahead and go back to my little girl right here, Aaliyah. That's right, Aaliyah the Pikachu. Now, am I going to evolve this Pikachu? Well, I gotta get permission from my niece first to see if I should evolve it. So, here we go, Thunderbolt, for the win. Oh yes, oh yes. Seal, you're getting your butt kicked right now. You really are. Now, another cool thing about uh, the Sevi Islands, eventually you'll get to capture some more Pokemon. Pokemon from the Johto region, well, some Pokemon from the Johto region, and uh, maybe one or two Pokemon. I don't know about Emeralds or Sapphire's Pokemon, but yeah, some Johto Pokemon are going to be able to, you're going to be able to capture right here. And uh, look at that, Dugong is being a dick right now and going to sleep. So, let's go wake it up with a Thunder Attack and run. Alrighty, I see how it is. Let's go, thunder attack! God dang it! Uh, okay, he—it's he, only prolonging the inevitable. But here it is, thunder attack for the win. Suck it, Dugong. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> Dugong's getting its butt kicked, and Amara defeated. That's right. Okay, so let's see. I, yeah, this little island right here, what, 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 I don't remember what it was called, but you can actually find some hidden items here every single day. Uh, let's see, talk to this guy. Good things get washed up by the by the ocean current onto this beach. That's why I often come here for some uh, beach bomb, beach combing. So, let's go right ahead and use our, our what was it, an, our item finder right here. So, let's see, where the hell are you? Where are you? Um... Crud. I, oh, wow! I forgot to get it! Good God! Okay. Okay, so I'm just gonna walk around like a total jackass and just hope hope that I get something. Hope that I get something here. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, not only that, but you'll actually find some pretty good Pokemon here, too. You know, uh, Fero, Persian, come to mind. And, uh, well, there's nothing right here. Maybe right here onto the ocean floor, or the, the, the beach... The beach floor. God dang it. There's no oh, okay. So you know what? I'm gonna wait for you until next time because you know what? Good old Draven forgot about the uh, whole item finder right here. So that's enough of that right there. And uh, well, 
Now it's time to go straight to the next area right here of the One Island area. So let's see, we're going to be going into Kindle Road. And believe it or not, there is a volcano around here. And uh, quite a surprise. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to switch Polyswag with Execumon. And uh, let's go. I'm beginning to get a sunburn. Okay. Let's see what your sunburn is. So, here we go, Abigail would like to battle, and she is coming out with a Psyduck. You know, that Pokemon that I wanted to use in the beginning, instead of a uh, Poliswag, or, you know, Patrick. That's right, my biggest mistake ever. Here we go, Giga Drain, for the win. Look at that, you gotta love it. A lot of these Pokemon guys that you're gonna be finding around here, they are within your, your level after defeating uh, Blaine. Uh, at the uh, Cinnabar Island Gym, and uh, well, it, good thing about this game too is that you actually have the BS Seeker as well. So that means that you can battle him any single time. And uh, would you look at that? Psyduck has been uh, getting his butt kicked right now. Executmon just taking points, taking so many points right here. And here she comes out with a Golduck. So let's just keep our Executmon right here. Go with the Giga Drain and crud! The Disable takes our, dis our Giga Drain away. So, that prevents us from hitting this guy. Let's go right ahead and use Psychic. Alrighty, so it's a Psychic battle right here. Let's see what's happening right now. Oh, crud. Okay, so I'm confused now. Okay, come on! That's right. Let's go, Executmon. Use that Psychic attack. Takes a good chunk, and here we go again with another Confusion. See, this is the reason why I wanted to use a Golduck, because it's a little faster than uh, than most Pokemon right here, and yeah, look at that, it's kicking my butt right now, so come on! Come on, Executumon, don't be a bitch. That's right, and uh, still confused. Let's go, let's go, and Psychic Attack for the win. And that is how you do it. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty, okay, so... That's another Pokemon uh, trainer down, and she's saying that we're awful. Hmm. Now, I would like to ask the question right here, guys. The Sevi Islands, do you guys think this is all part of Kanto, or is it, you know, that right there in between, uh, you know, right between Johto and Kanto? You know what I mean, or is this what the Orange Islands are, uh, the Orange Islands are supposed to be, if that was uh, canon or anything? And here we have, this is Kindle Road, goes straight to Mount Ember, which is the volcano. And, uh, believe it or not, yeah, there is an actual volcano right here, guys. Um, Cinnabar Island claims to have a volcano, but I see no volcano right there. So, let's go ahead and battle another trainer. See what we can do. Let's go. Here we have Picnicker Claire coming out with her meow. Meow, 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 meow. Alrighty. Okay, so, I'm gonna go with the slash attack. I'm not even gonna waste my time. That's right. Anywho, guys, how are you guys enjoying my Pokemon Black series? Yes, sir. Pokemon Black is, is out. And, uh, yeah. Making big, big strides. Now that it's a... Uh, now that it's a, whatchamacallit, a live com series. And, uh, hoping to get more walkthroughs out. Or mock -through, more walkthrough videos out while I'm still doing this right here, guys. So, uh, make sure to click on that like button. Subscribe, all that stuff. Pikachu, why are you double teaming me, man? Come on! Don't be like that. Here we go. Dig attack. Misses! Good God. Okay, so this Pikachu is like... is a crafty one. Okay, so let's go with a Rock Slide and... Uh, okay, so this Pikachu is starting to get on my nerves and I don't think I have a move that... Go oh, crud. Ah, Jesus. Okay, so let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so summary. Let's see, hold on. Uh, nope. Nope. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Crud. So, I'm kind of stuck right here, guys. I don't have any moves that can't that can't miss, so I'm going to have to try and miss a few attacks right here. Um, you know, risk getting uh, paralyzed and all that stuff. Alright, here we go. Brick Break. That's right. And there goes Pikachu. Alrighty. And uh, Thrasher does not get paralyzed right here, so let's go ahead and... Keep on going with Thrasher because you know what? Here's a Clefairy. Let's go, Brick Break. The Brick Break right here. Alrighty. Yeah, buddy. And there it goes. Bye bye. 
Bye bye And, uh, wow, well, it's like a normal type Pokemon uh, galore right here, so... Let's go right ahead and use this Brick Break, looking at, and get that. And that is how you do it. No more Meow. Alrighty. See? This is a very, very good place to actually get your Pokemon experience points. Very, very good place. Although, some of these Pokemon are at the first form right now. Now, let's see. I still have my... Yeah, I still have my Repel on. Now, at this point, you might think that you have the Rock Smash technique, but you don't. But if, I think you do get it right here, so... What I'm going to do right now is, uh, let's go ahead and switch out Pokemon. Let's go with Tank. Tank, it's been a while, buddy. It has been a while. So here we go. You know, everything tastes great when you're out in the wild. Get on say. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. Camper Bryce would like to battle. Coming out with his Nidorino. I'm coming with Tank. Alrighty, Tank. You know what to do. Body Slam. And, of course, there's that poison attack that really doesn't fare as well. So here we go. Body slam for the win. Yeah, buddy. Nidorino gets his butt kicked. And uh, look at that. Thrasher grows to level 42. Always good. And he's coming out with the Sand Slash. So let's go right ahead and take Poliswag out. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty. So let's see. Another thing about the Sevi Islands. Let's see. What, what else is pretty good about it? else is very very good about it well, you'll find different stuff different Pokemon eventually once you get to islands four and seven four through seven you'll find the Johto Pokemon I think I mentioned in Pokemon uh, in my Pokemon platinum walk through that right around this time in the Nintendo what was it yeah in the, the Nintendo Game Boy era through the Nintendo eh, right or generation three basically uh, there was a lack of Johto Pokemon they only selected a few and yeah, a lot of people didn't really like it. Me in particular didn't really like it because it was like, I kind of miss Johto. And I think that's the reason why they came out with the remake the year later because, damn, the remake was pretty damn good. Which, by the way, I will be doing uh, soon enough, I think. And, uh, well, let's see. There's a trainer right there. Don't want to battle her right now. And if I, had, if I had the hidden item technique, or not the hidden item type technique, if I had the, the what you would call it, uh... If I had the item finder, then I probably would have worked. It probably would have worked out right here. So let's go right ahead and battle this chick right here. Let's see what she's got. There isn't a day in which we don't train. Hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go. Let's see what we got. Tanya would like would like to battle, and she's coming out with her Hitmonlee. I'm coming out with Godzilla, and uh, here we go. Fly attack. Yeah, buddy. And uh, Mind Reader, what does that do? Seriously, what does Mind Reader do? There we go. Fly attack for the win. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Okay, okay. So we're kicking butt right here. He's coming, or she's coming out with a Hitmon Chan. Eventually, we get, we're gonna get to see uh, Hitmon Top and stuff. So here we go. Here we go. Fly attack. And here we go again. Fly attack for the win. That's right. Okay, alrighty, look at that. My Pokemon are kicking ass. What about yours? What about yours, guys? Alright, so we don't have Rock Smash just, just about now, so we're gonna have to move it on right here, and uh, I think we've already battled these guys. We need to actually get a Repel right here, because I don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon right now. Who doesn't want to get attacked? Alright. Let's see. Alright, so there's a swimmer, so let's go right ahead with our Pikachu right here. Let's see. Pikachu, there you are. And bring it on. I took a break from swimming, only to have you to challenge me? Wow, he kind of sounds like uh, he's untouchable or anything like that. So here we go. Swimmer Garrett would like to battle. Coming with his Shelter. Alright, Shelter. See how you are. I battled you your kind before. Let's go with the Thunderbolt right here, and good god, there's that Protect right there. Mm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh god. Seriously? Here we go. Thunderbolt. There we go. Thunderbolt for the win. That's right. That's how you do it. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. And, well, let's see. He's coming out with a Cloister, so we're going to have some fun right here with some Evolve Forms. And more experience points. So here we go. Another protect. Okay. I see how it is. Cloister protecting itself. 
but it won't be protected at long. So here we go. Thunderbolt. Or Thunder, I should say. So here we go. Thunder attack for the win. Yeah, buddy. Say goodbye to Cloyster. Alrighty, okay, okay, and okay. And uh, War Turtle's coming out, so let's just keep Aaliyah right here and just kick some butt right now. So let's go Thunderbolt. Man, seriously, knock it off with the Protect. Oh god, okay. Here we go, here we go. Thunderbolt. For the win. Alrighty, alrighty. And there you go, War Turtle's been getting his butt kicked. That's pretty good. Look at that, Thrasher, look at that, and Gary, okay, so he's like, hey, what the, you're good, huh, you, oh yeah, of course, I don't know how to read anything, so there's one more item right here that we need to get, um, actually, we need to surf to it, to get to it, okay, alrighty, alrighty, so here we go, and we found ourselves another Max Repel, which is also good, and, uh, well, gonna move on again so let's see uh, we've already battled these people now let's see no rock smash right now and uh, we got a training couple right here so let's go right ahead and use Pokemon that are actually going to survive against this guy or these guys right here and uh, believe it or not guys these are the these are the people that I actually go to to actually train uh, against before I go up against the elite four uh, eventually their levels will go up after you've defeated them quite a few times here we go, Crushkin, Mick, and Kia want the battle. And they're coming out with a Primeape and Machoke, okay. Okay. Okay, Sue, okay, so let's see. Fly attack on you, and Psychic on you. Okay, so that, that I might have made a mistake right there. Holy crud. Holy crud, I should have gone with uh, the Primeape. So Primeape is going to go unscathed. And uh, here's the Psychic attack. Finishes off that Machoke. Alrighty. Okay, and uh, okay, look at that. And uh, Psychic on you, and here we go. Fly attack. Primeape dies. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Kick it some butt right here. Okay. So there you go. Defeated the uh, <laughs> the kin couple right here. Alrighty, so let's move on. Let's see. Oh, yes. And I usually battle these guys too. Their Pokemon are usually are usually leveled up ready and go alrighty so it's gonna be a double battle right here no it's not good god okay so here we go black belt you would like to battle coming with his much up much up I should say and I'm going with the Godzilla because Godzilla can do Godzilla things <sighs> alrighty okay so much up trying to do its thing right here but here we go with a fly attack can it do it finishes off that much up that's right. Okay. Alrighty. Look at that. And uh, Thrasher grows to level 43. Learning Mega Horn. Finally, a new move. What kind of a? Oh, it's a Bug type move. Look at that. Super powerful. Okay. So, damn it. Okay. So let's see. You know what? I can always get Dig. Okay. I can always get Dig. So I'm just gonna replace it. I think Pikachu has Dig, so don't worry about it, guys. I will teach uh, I will teach Neo King uh, Earthquake eventually. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna try out that new move. Actually, no, I'm not gonna try it out. I'm gonna go with Poliswag right here. So here we go, Poliswag, looking all pimping and stuff with its three knuckles, and it's about to do a Surf Attack just to finish these guys off. There we go. There we go. And uh, oh crud, this Seismic Toss. This is going to be bad. This is going to be... Okay, no, it's not. So here we go. Surf attack. For the win. Eat it, Bajoke. And look at that. My Pokemon growing levels, like always. Alrighty, so let's see. We got another Pokemon trainer right here. Every morning before breakfast, I swim around this island. Okay. Okay, so let's see what this guy's got. Black Belt Shia. Shia, Shia, Shia. Shia or Shia like to battle and uh, we're gonna go with the same formula right here fly attack seismic toss everything in between here we go ah your foresight it doesn't do anything so here we go fly attack for the win and that's how you do it yeah buddy yeah buddy yeah buddy alrighty so coming out with another macho let's go straight to Executmon right here get some more experience because you know what Godzilla not supposed to be the only one getting 
all that, all those points right there. So here we go, Machoke, looking all beefy and stuff, but it will not withstand a psychic attack right here. Yeah, buddy. Suck on that, Machoke. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. And look at that. And he's gasping for air because he just got beat. All right, so there is probably one trainer here. Now, as you can see right here, look, light fire, light the fire in your heart, Ember Spot. Now, there is a trainer here. I'm going to battle her, and then we're gonna go into the spa. So, yes, we're gonna be helping her out with the uh, with the trainer right here. So, let's go. Crush Girl Sharon would like to battle, and she will be coming out with her monkey, uh, Mankeymon. Alrighty, okay, let's go. Fly attack. We can do this. Destroy her. Make her feel bad because he's only got fighting type Pokemon. Alrighty. Alrighty. So there you go, Mankey defeated. And, uh, well, let's see. He's coming out with a Prime Ape, so let's go right ahead and go back to Executumon. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, so. Let's see. Let's go with the Psychic Attack. And, uh, of course, Prime Ape. It's pumping up, so we gotta hit him pretty quickly right here. And uh, there you go, Primeape defeated. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. And uh, well, I'm cut above you. Yes, I am. Alrighty. So let's go back into the spa right here. And uh, now, if you enter the spa here, there's two things that you can actually find. A spa that can heal your Pokemon at any time, and a person that will actually give you the HMO6 for the Rock Smash. So talk to this guy, I think. Soaking in the hot, uh, spring pool is therapeutic, people say. Okay, it is. It is. So let's go right in here. If you talk to this lady, she's like, have a look at my face. See how smooth my skin is? The hot spring is water. Keep my uh, skin younger than my age. Eh, well, true. And, uh, well, let's go in here. Look at that. Perfectly warm, it feels exquisite, my Pokemon are fully regenerated, so that's one place you can actually heal your Pokemon. Now, if you talk to this guy, hot springs go hand in hand with volcanoes. The Ember Spa here, well, I made it years ago. I hewed the pool right out of uh, a gigantic boulder by hand. I was using this at the time. I suppose I could part with it. And here it is, guys, the HMO6. Yeah, buddy. That is the Rock Smash technique. So, um... Am I going to teach somebody Rock Smash? Probably so, because uh, I think uh, the next few areas right here, we're going to need Rock Smash. So, what we're going to do right now, guys, is I'm going to pause the game right here. We're going to be going into Mount Ember pretty soon here. Hopefully capture Moltres at the, uh, in the meantime. And uh, continue on with our adventure to, you know, Islands 2 and 3. So, stay tuned, guys. I'll be back for another episode of Pokemon Leaf Green. See you guys.